All right, to start your holiday card, to new 2D sketch, select the front view, and then you're going to use your line tool. You're going to click, you want to go down, you want to see the uh, vertical constraint you can see there on the bottom, and then that blue box, you're going to type point one and just hit enter. Don't click anything with your mouse, and you're going to make the downward part of your angle at the bottom of the card. Um, just put your mouse down and then type in 5.5 in that blue box because that's the dimension it's supposed to be. Scroll out with your mouse. Press down on your center scroll and your hand, it'll turn to a hand you can slide your paper over. Now make the upward part of your angle. Type in 5.5 again. Hit enter. S center scroll of your mouse to move, move your paper over a little bit. And now this next line that we put in, you want to have that perpendic perpendicular constraint. And you can see there it also says that it's 90 degrees. So that white box is 90 degrees. You want that. And then in here we want to type in point 0.1 and hit enter. And then we're going to start making the top portion of our card. And we want the parallel constraint. You want the bottom line and the top line parallel to each other. And you can see I have the parallel constraint. Type in 5.5, hit enter. And now hit your center scroll again on your mouse. Change to a hand. Slide your paper over. Scroll in so you can see the very top of the line you made the first time, that point one. And you want to connect it there. You want the green center dot. You don't want yellow because that's not connected. Green center dot shows that it's connected. Click. Now we need to dimension out this center angle. So click your dimension. Let's click to dimension the center angle. You're going to click the top two lines that make that angle. So it's this line. And then click your second line. That's what makes the angle. Pull it up. And you're going to type in 150 because that's what it's supposed to be. Hit enter. Finish your sketch. Hit your house button so you can see it. Then extrude it. And you're going to extrude it 8.5 because that's the length of a piece of paper. And hit OK. Now, when you go to sketch on this, you're only going to sketch on the inside part of your card. You're only going to put your features on the inside part of your card. So create a 2D sketch. Put your pencil paper on one side, and then you can use all these different draw features uh, to make make your feet make your designs. So if I was going to make a snowman, say, I would draw my snowman. I would finish my sketch. I would extrude each of my circles. You can change whatever depth you want them to be extruded. Hit OK. Now if I want to put a face on my snowman, get my pencil. Click the top portion of it, because that's where I want my face to go. And you can start designing things. I couldn't put my face on the first time I made my circle, because otherwise I wouldn't be able to extrude it. If I want eyes. You don't have to dimension any of your features on on your snowman or on your card except when you make it. Finish my sketch and now when I extrude my snowman I can just extrude the parts of his face and hit OK. If you want to color them you can use your browser, right click on it, go to properties and choose the color and hit OK. And then he changes his color. Alrighty, that's how you make your holiday card.